If you're doing drop off, step to the left line. If you're voting in person, stand in this middle line. When we talked with Ramsey County Elections Manager David Triplett last year, traffic at this elections office looked a lot different in 2020 than 2021. As you can tell, there's no line, no tent. Uh, we're open for voting here. Uh, but the volume is considerably less than it was in a presidential election, which is which is pretty pretty normal. Triplett says in a normal election, 30,000 voters in Ramsey County vote absentee, where in last year's presidential election, there were 197,000. Election officials have been experiencing this increase for years. I think in Ramsey County, every year since 2010, we've seen a slight increase in absentee voting. Uh, we just saw a dramatic increase in 2020. Uh, so we've seen those trends nationwide in states like California, Colorado, uh, elsewhere have kind of implemented a lot of laws to accommodate early voting. Um, so it's, it's a national trend that we're experiencing here as well. Though it's not a presidential election year, there are several city council and school board elections locally. You can find more voting information on the Secretary of State's website, including registration and polling locations. Triplett says the elections office is in the business of elections, so the more they can help in the process, the better. You know, you don't go to school for elections, but if there were a class, transparency would be 101, and I think last year officials across the country realized the importance of being transparent about what they're doing uh, and letting the public be involved, uh, and that has benefited us a lot here in Manzacan.